All right, welcome to Life of SOK 350 Lover. Gonna be continuing on with Cyberpunk 2077 for PlayStation 5. What the hell, dude? I'm innocent. Get the hell out of here. The freak, man. Dude, scared the crap out of me. So I'm outside of this building here doing a dream on mission. For the Pirellis family. Uh, it seems like there's some Maelstrom people that are involved with this. And I had to chase down this van to this place. And we got in a shootout. I used like hacking. And I think most of them are taken out. Is that guy gone now? I guess he ran off. <laughs> it's weird. So yeah. Where did he disappear to? It's weird. I don't know. So yeah, anyways, let me catch you up to my character V, level 28, 45 street crit, 254 for 10,993 eddies, nice little outfit here. This is what I'm using, uh, I was just using a sniper rifle to kind of spot on people. Um, let me change this to the Kappa. Uh, let me start from the beginning, crafting it is 9, still trying to get this Edge Runner Artisan, which will be... Technical ability 18. <clears throat> so these are my crafting things, which are pretty much things that I own or new things. New crafting things I picked up. Upgrades. I have been upgrading the red coat. Inventory. Kappa. Uh, pistol. The Comrade Hammer. And the Short Smart Sniper Rifle. For my head, uh, I just have this cap. I need to get rid of that. I just been really keeping only legendary or epic stuff. Oh, I could wear this now. The Terrorist Kus Kusuta Armored Wii Crystal Jock Bomber. <clears throat> 1 12.7 armor plus 3% mitigation speed uh, strength. Punks who don't believe in dress codes, but if. Punks don't believe in dress codes, but if they did, this would be on it. So this matches my pants for sure. Alright, because I forgot I hit level 28 and it's a 28 coat. I like this outfit. I might have to save this. This one. Huh? What the heck just happened? Oh, this goes by what's in my wardrobe. Oh, uh, where did this one come from? All right, never mind. I don't know. I had to go to my wardrobe and save this one. This is nice. I like this. I would wear this even in real life. Okay, so, um, all right, so that's the coat there. The rest of my stuff is either epic or legendary. There's tank top, which is epic. I have some legendary stuff that's in my um stash as well, but I don't feel like carrying all this stuff. Let me get rid of these. Sh oh, that's right. They got the armor thing on there. The armor dillo. Stats. These are my stats. 84 uh, hours and 38 minutes. Corpo. <clears throat> you can look at my stuff. It's a lot better than when I first started. And my next... Oh, I'm 45 Street Crew. Okay, so weapons vendors will now have weapons to sell. Cool. Uh, new weapons to sell. Alright, and my last one will be level 50. Rip it out, so sell you new cyberware at level 50. Okay. Um, grenades. These are my grenades. I also had a projectile lunch system, which uses the same slot as the grenades, which is stupid. And the blood pump, which uses the same slot as the grenades, which is stupid. Um, Biotech MK3. Epic Cyberdeck with Suicide. I've been using slot Cyber Psycho. Short circuit, contagion, and overheat. And these are the other quick hacks that I have. I need to get some legendary ones. I need to go to that guy in the afterlife to see if he'll sell me some different ones. But <clears throat> I haven't had a chance to. Been so busy with missions. Um, So this stuff. Uh, Crochet Optics MK3 with these mods. And then I have this one. This one, this one, this one, this one. This one, this one, this one's fairly new. Smart Link Legendary. And the, what else is new? What kind of is this? The MK3s are new. 
this projectile launch system, I don't really like this. I thought it would be like really killing people. But I mean, when I hit somebody's like 100 damage, I do better off using the um, grenades, honestly. Um, map, I am here um, in the Watson North side. And this is the building here. Here's my perk and attribute tree, body 10. Here's my perks that I have. I have reflexes 7, technical ability 12. Engineering uh, stuff, perks. Intelligence 10, and these are the perks that have breach protocol. And quick hacking. I was thinking about resetting my perks, but it's so expensive. 11,200. I'm just like, eh, never mind. Let's keep it as is. Cool. Nijitsu. Dagger Dealer. Assassin. Hidden Dragon. Cold Blood. I have one. Journal. Here are the missions we have completed so far. NCPD side mission, main story mission, side gig missions, NCPD missions, bought an apartment and north side, bought a car, not buying any more cars. Um, you name it, I've done it. Cyber cycle missions. Uh, that is the last one that I did along with following the river. Uh, apartments, these are the three I have that I could buy. I'm trying to get Japan town when I get enough money. Principal vehicles, here are all the ones. This is a new one, Xi'an MZ2. I think it was from that uh, Cyber Psycho job lady. Um, Xi'an MZ2, buy the vehicle for 57000 No thanks. Hey, hey, there's a Muzutani Xi'an that's looking for a new home. One line might be a little beat up. Previous chick who owned it liked to let foot the pedal, but the engine suspension brakes, everything that matters, all in premium condition. Rides like a pure dream. This baby's a classic and a fast one at that. Perfect for losing the 500. Oh, and the flooring might be a little bit stained. Coffee, blood, hard to tell. Okay. So that is what we currently have. I don't know why it's still saying it's new. Um, hold on. Cyber Psycho Sightings. This thing is still not showing up on the map. Even though I went to it before, still like bugged. Several cycle sighting on the bridge. I passed by that one. So that should be there. Main jobs are on hold. Takimura down on the street. And on the map, love with Judy because I'm waiting for the... I keep saying this over and over again. Cyberpunk 2077 DLC, which uh, Phantom Liberty has come out a couple of weeks. So it's supposed to pick up in Pacifica. Um, so I'm a couple of missions away from that, so I'll just leave this as is and just do side jobs for now. Right now I'm doing Dream On. Uh, we also have Fool on the Hill, Get All the Turk, Graffiti, Tune Up with Delamain, Psycho Killer, and Beat on the Brat, which I need to level up more. So, this is the job that I'm doing. Elizabeth Perales, who is the wife of Jefferson Perales. She's a lawyer and a mom, and her, they have one daughter. Zochi, Zouchi, whatever lady name is. She gave up her career to um, help her husband, who's running for mayor of Night City. And he is a lawyer, former district attorney, a counselor on the Night City Council, and he wants to be the next mayor of Night City. This uh, power couple, um, they obviously power couple because, I mean, if you see their penthouse, they have a lot of money. Basically, when uh, Lucy is Rhines, the former Night City mayor died. Um, they wanted to look into why he died. I guess they were friends. I seen a photo of them together in the house. Man, they just could have took a photo with him. Anyways, uh, he died. And uh, they wanted to look into why he died. Along with me and River Ward. We looked into it and come to find out <coughs> he was murdered. With a BD that was spiked. Had a virus in it. And well, then Holt, who is the new mayor, who was his assistant mayor and deputy mayor before um, this guy is his successor. He took over when the other mayor died and kind of find out he's involved with it. Along with Detective Han, who is River Ward's friend, who was a detective that I've been working with to uncover Lucien Ryan's murder. 
So it's a bunch of stuff, you know. Um, so they're aware of what's been going on. And it looks like somebody bugged their house. And been watching what they've been doing. And listening to them. Because there was some kind of transmitting machine. Which was transmitting uh, maybe their surveillance. Because uh, they have surveillance cameras in their penthouse. And their security team at SSI. Looks like they were doing some dirty stuff too. Because Jefferson had called me over to ask me to look into an intruder that came into the house that he shot and he's trying to figure out what's going on so i think it's related to them snooping around uh trying to find out why the mayor was, mayor was killed but um tremon connect to the vans at this point well well special favors for politicians thank you got any caught here paralysis may seem like decent and down to earth folk but um let's see not since no in the corpse pockets like the rest but they're still part of the running elite V. If they got to step over you to get to the top, they won't hesitate. Don't believe even for a second that they're different. So that's what we're going to do. So let's do it. I'm keeping my perk point. I saw something flying there. So this is the aftermath of everything. Let me just take my car and put it over here. There is one more person here. One more. So what I'm gonna do is get down. I'm gonna connect to the camera that's here. Oh, not computer. Uh, where's the camera? So hard to lock on this stuff. That's radio. Well, that's the person up there. Where's the camera at? I know it's here. Satellite dish. Savannah's camera. Here we go. Camera control. Alright. So, uh, I don't know if you've seen the last video, but I gotta be careful because somebody, um, they sent like a, um, that's me over there. They sent like a car in here with more Maelstrom, so I don't want them to accidentally kill me. Well, I shouldn't say accidentally because nothing is accidental, right? So, Fanatic, I'm gonna do a cyber cycle on him because there's another dude and I want him to find him. Let's just see. Like and basically, cyber cycle the way it works. If he can't find anybody, then he is off himself. So we'll see. There we go. Yep. So this guy just ran out and he just shot him. Uh oh. So there's a sniper there, too. So that's done. So let me see if I can get him to commit suicide. It's gonna be out of out of reach though. Alright, so he just be off himself. He's rolling down the stairs. Okay, great. Now we just gotta find out where the sniper is at. So this is the entrance, so it's somewhere here. The sniper is at industrial shutters. Reach protocol. Uh do we wanna shut down all the cameras? Uh yeah, okay, so 55. 55 E9 BB and then a uh, I can't do anything All right and with that being shut down this one shut down it's weird Yep, they're off. Let's 
just facing the street. Close these. So I close the shutter there. See if I can close the other shutter. So he can't see. Okay. Alright, that will work. Save the game. Just in case some somebody tries to pick me off. But because the shutter is closed, they can't see me, I would hope. So yeah, this is Maelstrom Maniac. Great, just make all the noise you can, V. Is it door? Hack into here. So we need to get 55. That's not going to be that easy. 7A55. 7A1C. Okay. 7A55. 7A1C. And then we can come back and get the... Oh, shoot. I am so screwed. Uh, you know... Oh, it's better than nothing, I guess. Okay. I'm sure up that stairs is probably where that person is at. What the hell? Look at all that noise. Like they want me to get killed. I'm gonna come back to that. And the light dish. So the door here. Close this. One ninety two euro dollars, yeah. Okay. 
What do we have so far in my inventory? Got the these basic guns. Get rid of these. Get rid of this. 102 to 124. Oh yeah, I'm keeping that one. That's the one I had before. Uh, the smart submachine gun. Yeah, that looks like that's it. Got some new shoes. These reinforced plastic fleets. They are elegant, but that's kind of the point. Okay, these match too. But not better than the spunky monkeys. Okay. Which is the same as the drink. Um, so 12,973 of these, okay? Alright, let me go ahead and save. Now there's something on top of here. I can hack this. Check in. Alright, so we want to do a 7A, 55, 55, 1C, okay? 75, 55, 1C. And then we want to come back with the 1C. Then we do another 1C and we go over here. 1C, 1C, 7A. Bam. How much money they gave me? They did not give me any money. Nope. What the hell? Only components. That's the first. You said they give me eddies too. Let me read this computer. See if I can make sense of anything. No, this is just the net. Uh, this is some new ones here. Execution time. If your life is m missing gore, do you fall asleep during? Oh, shoot. What the heck you do? Turn all these cameras off. Execution time. What is this? If your life's missing, Gordy, you fall asleep during horror movies where people are clutching their disemboweled intestines, feeling feel like children's lullabies. Sounds like it's time for execution time. Oh wow! Watch River Execution real time. Militech. Fish or <laughs> Excuse me. <coughs> wow. What's this one? Join in USA when the man return a night city to the new United States of America. Okay, so night city is some part of America. Interesting. And 54 news. Look at that. They have about the mayor. You're not subscribed. What? Mayor Ryan has passed away. Though the news is sad on the spectrum, it presents night city with opportunity for change. Some of his close colleagues said of Ryan that he always wanted best for night city, but he wasn't always prepared to take the road. Right decision in science with Irasaka is 
Can't even subscribe, what the heck? The way you are here, therefore you think, you think, therefore you have money. You have money, so you know the child is a high risk investment, but not with us. With our patent education system, way you can sleep easy knowing your child will become a proper corporate individual. Okay. And your island. Man made island developer living on paradise. If only you could get away with the clamor and chrome of the city, throw everything away and live like a filthy rich hermit. Think the best you can, okay? And then Arasaka, loyalty, pragmatism, and discipline. Yeah, pass. Kind of alarm or something, it's weird. Here's some kind of alarm going on. Librium Arbitum. Okay, I don't know what that means. Not the. Not related to the mission, I don't really care. Alright, so once he, once he. Or 1C, 1C. 1C, 1C. 1C, 55, okay. 1C, 1C. 55, 7A. Okay, I'm gonna do 3. Okay. Use, and that's just the net. He's a fanatic mushroom. Thank you. 
the WCF, visa holders can earn the right to... <laughs> Try and send a grenade. Make to the vans at this point. I'm not gonna do that right now. Still getting pick up things. No. Alright, so this is where I came in before. Next stop. Can't open the shutter. The dude that rolled down the stairs have to commit suicide. There's somebody right here. Can we get to this laptop? Okay, check in. Let's get some eddies or some components. Alright, so 55. 55, 1C. No. 55. Uh, 55, 1C. 7A. 7A. 7A, 9. Okay. 55, 1C. 7A, E9, 1C, what? I don't even know, I thought that was it. What, why did she jump up there like that? What the hell? Okay, use, just a net, okay. Alright, so last but least is to go in here and connect to the vans thing. What did I get? Got some regular weapons. Regular weapon. Regular weapon. Regular weapon. Regular weapon. Regular weapon. A lot of components I'm gonna get. Regular weapon. Regular weapon. Oh, got a RT46 Boria. 342 to 419. Legendary pistol, always ready to fire. Altogether, now true match. Glory to the progress of the Soviet socialist scene. But the thing about it is, I already have the um, Comrades Hammer, so that really takes care of that, so I don't need that. Okay, anything else? Get rid of this Unity. Uh, yeah, that should do it. What else? I got a new Congo towel, stretchy motorcycle jacket, increased medication, stripped by 3%, designed by aerodynamic comfort of mine. That is so ugly. Dang. Let me put my clothes back on that I had before. That is just hideous. What I get? I got these uh, composite corset, 33.2 armor. Don't worry, your retinas will be fine. Oh, okay. That's cool looking. 
And I got this Technopolymer Lab Info Visor. Stylish and convenient substitute for optical cyberware. Okay. It's kind of the same as this, just different color. So, let me get rid of this one. But I do like this one. That's really cool. Alright. And, uh, got these Electric Marble Ultralight Athletic Shoes. Beauty of Flies MF on the battlefield. Okay. Not bad design, but that armor is terrible. Alright. And uh, it gave me some grenades, right? Alright, got these. And then I got some char incendiary. Okay. Um. That pig. Bunch of components. Okay. Target analysis. Max stocks. Bounce specs. Give me a hot dog and have my Nicola. Alright. And that is it for the most part. All that's left is to do the van thing. Kind of thing is this Emperor 620 Ragnarok. Jam packed with hardware. My optics don't see any manufacturer info or detect any mods. They don't mass produce trucks like those. What are they doing? What are they hiding? Earjacking. Huh. Could be the security firm or government. Media scouting for dirt on the paralysis. Yeah, he's right. Could be anything. Emperor 620 Ragnar. Uh, no external markings, occupants unknown, signature, EM signature, network, uplink capability likely, probable functions, communications, sig intelligence, and surveillance, okay. Alright, let's do it. All that's left to do is to check in. See what's what. Pierced it, we're in. Couldn't ask the NCPD for better records than this. Oh, Pictures, man. medical records. Vulnerability to neuroplasticity. Look at all that stuff. Some kind of database. Brain scans, the paralysis biological casts, neuroplasticity. Wow. Fuck. What about that? The blue shit. Fresh neural links. They're not spying on them, Johnny. They're fucking with their heads. Oh, that's why. You mean to say someone's literally controlling our upstanding politicians' minds? Hmm. Uh -huh. Red blots are memory residue in the hippocampus region. See how they're bleeding into the blue? So what are we looking at? They're planting new memories in their heads, modifying their personalities. Oh, this is big shit, Johnny. Maybe that's why her Johnny. head was hurting. She was like, I have a... Uh, besides the paralysis, too. She has a headache. Quick, download the data. Whoever comes looking for it, that's your suspect. Shit! They're wiping the data. We've been made. Now they know someone's been in their database. Wonder if they also know who. All right, let's get the hell out of here. Up into my car, I was about to say, okay, call Elizabeth. All right. Hey, Josh Kutcher. Uh, Regina Jones. Okay, this is gonna have to wait till later. Call. V, do you have any news? Gonna wanna sit down for this. It's, it's way bigger than we thought. What is? You were being brainwashed, literally. They've scanned your minds and now using some kind of conditioning to... Wait, not on the hollow. Right. I'll come by. No. You and I, we need to speak alone. I know a little ramen place in Japantown. Sending you the coordinates. Okay. Right. See you there. Go to the ramen shop. Okay, how far is it from here? 
All right, so I'm, I'm in the north side, and it's all the way over here in Japan town. Okay, just to save time. It's a little quick travel thing here. Let's go to here. Oh my god, come on. Go to Jig Jig Street. On my way. Oh, you again. Thank oh, you hey. again for your help. You're welcome. In the end, you did not help. Good intentions what do not just the hell? Shut Please. up, dude. Be my sympathy. Fine. Be my guest. I helped your brother when Maelstrom decided to cut this guy up. Rescue him, and that's the least he can do. Because he's like, oh, well, you can't murder people. Blah, blah, blah. That's worse. Like, what the hell? Okay. Join us today to fight for a better Peace is fragile. How do I get down to. How do I go down? Whatever you try. The hell? Listen to that guy. How'd you rate his chops? Who is this guy? Street musician. To my untrained ear, sounds all right, I guess. Easy listening, at least. No, why? Technique's second rate. But the feeling? That's what counts. Guy's hurt you, got something he can't take, and it shows. Could stand a little more stage presence. Fingering's all wrong, loses the tempo more than he keeps it, but not bad. Really know how to give a guy a compliment. That how you got your start? Street busker with big dreams? Don't make me laugh. No time for playing my way to the top. Was too busy shaking the world awake. <laughs> Ooh. Isn't that what every failed artist says about their work? Know what? You're right. I failed. Corpo tyrants still run this town, just like 50 years ago. But if you think in my heart of hearts I want to be the next teen idol, think again. Don't give half a fuck about that commercial shit. All right, Princess. At least you played some gigs. Saw those memories of yours. True. Played where we could. Parks, old factories, underground clubs. Had an audience from the start. Some recorded our stuff didn't even know who we were. Ooh, mean to say I could get my hands on some old samurai bootlegs? I'm gonna find those tapes. I'm gonna shriek like a little fangirl anytime you open your mouth. Happy? Just you fucking try. Jokes aside, you think those tapes still exist after all these years? Hmm, you know, Rainbow Cadenza is not far from here. Club we played till the band fell apart. Great spot. Place for people with their heads on straight. Maybe they'll know something. Okay, man, are we done here? Thank you. Sure, that's like a mission or something. Um, Johnny? Pretty sure they turned your great spot into a slurp shop. Mindless fucking consumerism wins the day again. Point for the other team. Huh. huh. This is why you don't bring back fallen warriors. Sooner or later, they're gonna see everything they fought for is turned to shit. All right. Let me save my game. What the hell? He's just walked through the... The people of Night City. Choose me as your mayor. The audio is off. My name is Jefferson Perales, and I approve this message. 
That's so weird that I'm coming here and then she's like in this place and then we gotta talk. But he's playing on TV. On my way, dude. Hey. Rainbow Cadenza mean anything to you? Oh no, another one. Aren't you too young for this? To what now? Every day, some sad grandpa in his old leather comes in here, asks where is his old rainbow club. And I'm like a broken record. Tell all of them the corp brought them out 20 years ago. <sighs> I should put up a sign. Yeah, that could be like you know annoying. Anything about bootlegs from the Rainbow Cadenza days? Now that uh, Buck Ravers. Samurai stuff. Let me see, I got a new mission. Ballad of Buck Ravers. Talk to Cook. Don't think I'm going all sentimental or anything. Honestly, I give a crap. If I got any fans left in this city, if someone hears one of my tracks and they get an itch to take to the streets, then that's effing Nova. But those old recordings don't matter anymore. If I'm listening to them, I don't care. Although, while we're on the subject, wonder how things are over at the Rainbow Kendoza. Okay. So that's here where we're meeting her at this ramen place, which is right by Jig Jig Street. Samurai. Oh, that ugly red face on black? Yeah, <laughs> even I know that one. Old guy comes by here sometimes wearing their shirt. Spends the whole time yakking with his psycho fan friends. Don't make trouble. Wouldn't happen to know where I could find them? You can find him living back in the 2020s. <laughs> but besides that, he's out there at the market. You mean he does his shopping there? I mean, you can do yours at his spot, assuming you'd even want to. He sells ancient dusty tapes of ancient dusty indie bands. No one's heard of a single one of them. Maybe it's the junk shop. Cream. Thanks. Buy something Come to eat, on. too. Please? I'm ready. All right, let's meet what with Elizabeth. Said? She looks Please? different. Even she has her hair braided. Thank you for coming. Mm, her legs wide open, too. Wow. Cozy little joint. Doesn't really match your style, though. And she got a hair shaving But it's back. perfect for a one on one. Here we are, then. What Tiger is it? Tiger claw people. I don't trust I... them. I'm sorry. My nerves are shot. I can't gather my thoughts. Wasn't that long ago we last met. Something happened since then? No. I mean, something did happen, though not recently. It's a long story. I don't quite know how to tell you. Where to even start? Relax. No need to rush. Ah. <sighs> uh, uh, a while ago, I started noticing some changes in Jeff's behavior. His personality... He seemed to be changing right in front of me. Becoming someone else. How so? He stopped reading, forgot the title of his favorite movie. Even his musical taste changed overnight. This guy keep coming back and forth there. Once, I said we should visit his brother's grave, and he told me that he'd been an only child. What the hell? That's when I started thinking something bad was happening. Something insidious. And not just with Jeff. Notice any changes in yourself? After some time, on several occasions, my friends pointed out that I was acting strangely. Oh, that must have been hard. It was. You know, it's at times like those you start to question reality. So the whole time you knew what I could end up finding. This guy keeps throwing that freaking. I don't know who, how, or pick why. Out thing but and they're coming changing back and us. Down, that concealed out. room in our apartment. 
What about it? I'm sure I'd seen it before, but again. must have somehow forgotten. I find that terrifying. Mentioned any of this to Jeff? I tried. I did. But he's blinded to everything. He just laughed, said I was imagining things. Mm. He once brought up a vacation that we never went on, swear to God. He went on about it in such detail, I almost started believing him. Could be just you who forgot. Maybe they just wiped the trip from your memory. Hell, I don't know anymore. Don't you get that? Haven't told me the whole story yet, have you? I saw a stranger in our apartment one night tinkering with the monitors. But I was in such a state by then that I didn't know if I could trust my own eyes. Mm. So you didn't do anything? I don't remember what happened. I talked to security the next morning. Find it strange you took this to security instead of your husband. I thought I was going insane. I wanted to see what was on the feeds first. There was nothing there, of course, so what was I supposed to tell Jeff? Mm. And then, the next day, I got a call. Who was it? Them. Whoever they are. Mm -hmm. There was a garbled voice on the other end. He never introduced himself. They threaten you? Try to blackmail you? They said I was walking on thin ice. That if we kept stirring up trouble, Jeff could have an accident. Then they wiped any record of our conversation. It was as if it had never happened. Mm -hmm. So I'm begging you, V. Jefferson can't find out about any of this. Ever. His life depends on it. What if you're just saying what they programmed you to say? Just reading off a script based on thoughts planted in your head. All I know is, I love my husband, and I want him to be safe, and... and happy. Or that's what they want you to know. You know what Jeff will do if you tell him? I know my husband. He'll start looking on his own. He can't find out about this. It... It'd destroy him. You knew who sent the intruder, but just strung me along anyway, Liz? Mm. I didn't have a choice. I didn't know what to do. Wanted everything to just go on and flow on, because it was convenient. <laughs> convenient? I got the perfect life. Prominent husband. You don't lack for a thing. You think I'm having fun? You have no idea what it's like living like this. I think Jeff pick a fight. He can't man. You think if I tell him everything that he'll go and pick a fight, he can't win? I don't just think. I know. One thing hasn't changed. Jeff's still a fighter. And he'll go down swinging. Huh. So how do we play this? I'm going to tell Jeff that SSI was spying for his rival, Holt. You just need to confirm what I say. And if I'm not on board? You have a choice. Just remember, any consequences will not be yours to deal with. Truly prepared to fire SSI? After the threats? It'd be brave, but risky as all get out. Now what they're doing to us coming. is one thing. But when you found that concealed room? I can't accept strangers spying on us while we sleep. Not under my own roof. What difference does it make where? I'll take full responsibility for anything SSI goes on to do. I'm just asking you not to get Jefferson involved. Mm -hmm. I'll add a meeting in Reconciliation Park to Jeff's schedule. He'll be waiting. Since I can't know if I'll remember this conversation tomorrow, I'm counting on you not to forget what I asked of you. I won't. But that's all I can promise. Goodbye, V. Whole thing's <laughs> fucked up, huh? Wouldn't sure want to is. Be in her pants. Speaking of, overlapping memories, changing personalities. Remind you of anything? Mm. But hey, at least we know what we're up against. Like a construct? No. No, this is different. Saw yourself. 
They're purposely modifying their mind's individual thoughts. Mm-hmm. Paralysis make a damn nice next-gen puppet. Even in my day, there were whispers about this kind of stuff. Cognitive pattern fluctuators, remote neural re-networking. In layman's terms, gaslighting. The beauty is that everything's fair game. Subliminal TV signals, high-density emitters in your electric toothbrush. You name it. So, in my pants, what would you do? Some real rat bastards behind this. Someone's got to take them down. Even by risking the Paralysis' lives? Fuck knows what kind of shit a mayor controlled by puppet masters could pull. But yeah, exactly. you could end up putting their lives at risk. Or not. Tough choice, V. Hey, you Meet with Jefferson. Your daddy? Save the game. I don't know what's going on. Sometimes you throw the food, it turns into something else. Been a night city long now? Long enough to know I should not answer seemingly harmless questions. Eat, pay, and be on your way. Dang, that lady's really muncha. Send the word space. Could go for a bite. I think yet. What can I get you? Oh, she's got a legendary chef knife for her. 33,406. That is crazy. Never required 29. Uh, coffee, latte, salami, and. I already got stuff to drink. Maybe I'll just get some uh, wontons and some tejini. Okay. And maybe one ramen. That's it. Alright, well, that's gonna do it for me because um, I'm running out of time. But uh, let's hey, see. Hey, looking for some good tunes. Got any laser pop? Something for muskrats? Don't sell no scop here. You either want good music or rainbow bright shite. Chill, Jim. Just a joke. <laughs> laser pop. Fucking laser pop. Here, at my stand. Heard I can get some decent tunes here. What you mean by decent? We got Cartesian duelists, Eurydine stuff, Tainted Overlord. Any samurai? <laughs> Kid, you even gotta ask? Never fade away. Dancing with my axe, chipping in. You name it, we got it. Silverhand was the one true messiah of rock. I'd hand them records out like candy if I could. But a guy's gotta eat. See, I found Silverhand's biggest fan. And proud of it. Today's bitty box rockers can't even touch him. Silverhand had something they couldn't even dream of. Uh, Silverhand? He had that fire, kid. Fire! Guy shook the foundations of the corporal world. He died for his ideals. Doesn't matter, he was also kind of a terrorist. Exactly. Blaze way down the rebel path. Alright, so I'm going to end it here because I'm almost out of time. I don't want to turn off. But we will continue on with this mission. Meet with uh, Jefferson and this Ballad of Buckrod Bravers next time.